All right, hi baby boss, welcome back to my channel. This is your next 48, episode 26 and 27 for baby boss, sun, moon, rising in the north node. Okay, so your overall message is election day. All right, so I feel like you're being selected, you're being elected, you're being nominated and you're going to win. I feel like you're going to win because of popular vote. All right, during the presidency or whatever the hell you wanna call it, it only requires that you're popular. Okay, you never hear this was the smartest vote, it was the most beneficial vote, uh, it was the most experienced vote. You hear it was the popular vote, okay? So the President of the United States is the most popular man in America. That's who he is, he's a celebrity, you, I mean, like it or not. All right, so I'm getting like, it only requires popularity for you to win something, and I'm getting you're going to win by a landslide because you're more popular, people like you better, or. You just know more people, all right? So I feel like I feel like your popularity kind of just gets you through the door. You know, you know a lot of people. It's not about what is it? What's that saying? It's not about what you know. It's about who you know. I think that's it, or something like that. But I'm getting you know hella people, or people just like you. I feel like too, somebody wants to see you in a certain position. Somebody wants to see you holding a certain, um, like holding a certain seat on something in a certain sect, organization, company. Like somebody wants to see you like on the board or at the round table. Like somebody wants you to make major decisions. They want to give you responsibilities. So I'm, I feel like you have a seat at the table here, just period. You've been selected to do this or you're going to be selected to do something just because by popular vote. People like, you. do you like Baby Boss? I like Baby Boss. We all like Baby Boss. All right, great. Baby Boss it is. All right, so Baby Boss, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. All right, Election Day. Okay. I'm also getting to something happen on election day or there's something significant about the actual election or inauguration or something like that. So somebody could be wanting you to speak on this. Uh, doesn't matter who you are. Somebody could, just, somebody could just be wanting your opinion. How do you view the election? How do you view the presidency? How do you view politics in general? I feel like somebody wants your input genuinely. All right, let's see, baby boss. Uh, sun, moon, rising, and the north node. Okay, other messages for you. 26 and 27. All right. Okay, so we have the five of pentacles. Okay, wow. All right, so I'm getting a recession. All right, so just period. I'm, I'm getting prices dropping or you're dropping the prices for someone or this is what somebody wants you to do. Somebody wants you to do something for cheap or somebody wants you to drop the price or so I feel like this is completely unrelated to your, your clear audience message. It is right now anyway. Okay, so we have the Five of Pentacles. So I'm getting you're no longer watching someone, supporting someone. You're not going to support someone anymore. You're not going to support this entity anymore, this air sign anymore. Ace of Pentacles, World Card, you're not going to support them, pay them, anything. I'm getting, they're not what you want. They're, they're, I feel like this person, there's something missing in this relationship. We have the Ten of Swords, it's over. All right, I'm getting like, you are initiating the breakup. You are, you are severing ties with this person. You're just going to flat out say that shit like, look, I don't want to talk to you anymore. Don't call my phone. Don't text me like you're fired or we don't need you. Please get your shit or something like that. I feel like it's going to be a very, someone's going to get fired very like harshly. Like I'm getting like, ouch. Okay. Like the way that you say something, it's like completely, there's like, you're completely not, there's, there, there's no sensitivity behind your words here at all. I feel like you want someone to get the fuck out and get the fuck out now. Or don't call you no more. Or it's over. You're done. You're fired. Or like Benito. Yeah, the Five of Pentacles is. It's the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's like, I feel like you're cashed out on someone, baby boss. You're like, man, I'm, yeah, I'm cashed out on your ass. Like, for real. What's the Five of Pentacles? Or like, somebody is like, like somebody's doomed. Yeah, we have the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, so I'm getting a child. All right, so I'm getting, I'm getting, um, you're abandoning a child. Maybe that's not yours or... This could be a project that you are abandoning or you're just abandoning. The, okay, what's the five of pentacles, page of pentacles? I'm also getting two. You're telling someone, if you can't afford my prices, then tough shit. I don't know what to tell you. That's not my, that's not my problem. Okay, what's the five of pentacles, page, page of pentacles, please? Or this is what you're telling somebody else. If you can't afford it, then okay, like... That's your problem, though. That's not my problem. Yeah, we have the Queen of Swords. Wow, really harsh energy here. Yeah, I feel like you are giving somebody the game about money, about affluence, about wealth, or about this air sign. Like you're giving somebody the fucking game. All right, what's the what's the Page of Swords? Or you're watching, like you're watching somebody give somebody else the game or something like that. I feel like somebody is eavesdropping though on your conversation. 
Yeah, we have the death card and we have the eight of swords and we have the three of pentacles. Definitely somebody's eavesdropping here. Somebody can hear you or somebody you're having. I'm getting a conversation about a scorpion that just keeps coming up or a conversation about somebody's death or I feel like something is over here, but somebody keeps bringing it up. Somebody wants to talk about it or like somebody's trying to make something out of nothing or somebody, I feel like somebody wants a whole bunch of money, but they're not trying to do shit to get that or they don't do shit. You're like, man, you don't even do nothing. All right. So I feel like somebody could too be, uh, could be complaining to you or asking you for money, but you're like, man, okay, what you trying to do for that money? Or are you going to work for that? Or are you going to just bitch and complain? Like, I feel like you don't respect people who don't work for their money or I feel like you are you don't like somebody who asks, who's asking for a handout or some shit like that. Yeah, the magician card like, man, get off your ass. Make your own money. Get your own money and shit. Stop, stop mooching off somebody or stop, I don't know, living off another person. What's the Ace of Pentacles? Yeah, you really hurting somebody's feelings. Yeah, we have the Three of Swords, the Devil card, Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, I really, I, I'm literally hearing you say, man, with your broke ass, you broke as fuck. That's why you're not doing shit. You, you never do shit or you don't have shit. You ain't never gonna, you ain't never had shit. Like something like that. What's the, uh, what's the 10 of swords? Yeah. The four of pentacles. Damn. Like you are really not having it. All right. So I feel like somebody's, someone's on your last nerves. Like for real. I feel like you're telling somebody flat out, shut the F up or you're not shit or you don't even do shit or you're a nobody or you're a lame or something like that. Um, now this could be, you could be telling somebody else this about another person, about a scorpion possibly, but I'm also getting too, like somebody just can't keep this air sign's name out of their mouth. They keep talking about this air sign over and over again, nonstop day in and day out, or they keep talking about this air sign's money or this air sign's life or what this air sign has or something like that. I feel like something that shit is getting, getting on your nerves. Yeah. We have the eight of wands and then we have the high priestess. The seven of swords. I'm also getting to something is pissing you off because you know that someone's lying to you. Somebody keeps lying to you. And I feel like it's starting to piss you off. You're like, man, stop lying. Like that shit lame as hell. What you lying for? Quick, stop the lying and shit. What is okay? What's this? So I'm getting I'm getting like you're over someone's bullshit. Just period. All right, what is this? It could be several people. Yeah, the two of swords, the magician card. All right, it could be several people that you're just over or that you're just done with, all right? Or this person is just like, they're useless. You can't, I mean, or you can't, uh, they're a bad partner or they don't do anything or they want you to do everything for them. Yeah, we have the magician card, page of wands, nine of wands. Yeah, it's like some, somebody is always expecting a handout or somebody's always expecting good news or like somebody is always like, um, I feel, I'm getting like good fortune, Cause I feel like I feel like you always have good news. You always share good news. You always got something good to say. You always got a happy story. You always got some good shit going on. Somebody's irritated by that. Someone's like, damn, you always happy, or you're always you're too positive, or you're fake. Okay, but I feel like I feel like you live a good life, and that irritates someone <laughs> because you're happy, you're confident, like. But I feel like somebody is like testing you, or like somebody wants to bring out the bitch in you, or like somebody wants to bring out the monster in you. All right, like you irritate them, baby boss. I'm getting to you could be irritating them because you always talk about a certain person or you always talk about a certain thing. Somebody feels like you, it's a, you know, it's a, maybe you monopolize the conversation, something like that. What's the three of pentacles? I'm getting to somebody could just be upset because you're, it's like somebody else is watching you or texting you or calling you or somebody else is supporting you. What's the three of pentacles? I feel like somebody wants you to stop talking to somebody else or somebody wants you to stop doing something. Someone's like, stop talking to them, stop doing that. Or what's the three of pentacles? Yeah, we have the title card. The nine of pentacles. Okay, yeah, I'm getting something about photos, a photo ID, driver's license, or a social security card. All right, so in other news, I'm getting, you may have trouble getting your money because you don't have the credentials, like you don't have your ID or some shit like that. Or you may feel stuck or somebody else feels stuck. All right. So I feel like there's there's a lot of frustration here. Like I feel like I'm also getting to, there's somebody here who, here who doesn't really support what you're doing. All right, but they, you it seems like you support them 
or they want you to support them, but they don't support you in any way at all. I'm getting physically, emotionally, monetarily at all. They don't support you. I kind of feel like there, there's something, I feel like somebody is like wants to use you or like, okay, one more card. Because yeah, the nine of pentacles, that's my pretty skinny and rich card, male or female, but it's someone who's like, they're doing very well for themselves. Very beautiful, unencumbered, probably, uh, you know, wealthy, good with their money. They live a good life. Justice card. Yeah, so somebody, like, I'm getting like you have a very balanced life here. Somebody else feels very stuck. They don't, they don't know what to do. So it's like somebody takes their anger out on you. Or like somebody ignores you or they neglect you because they're feeling some type of way. All right, this is a kind of a classic reading. All right, yeah, we have the Seven of Swords, Ace of Wands. I'm also getting two someone's attracted to you. But I feel, like, I feel like somebody wants what you have. They want to take it. This could be someone that you're dating. Or I feel like someone's attracted to you or someone's attracted to someone that you're dating. They, they want it. They want this person or they want what you have. Yeah, the star card. It could be somebody uh, who's very um, influential in the public eye or an actual celebrity big name. All right. The situation looks very confusing here, all right? But I kind of feel like somebody's like building blocks. It's almost like somebody's like building a web around you or like somebody's trying, like something is doctored here is what I'm getting. It's kind of like a scheme or a scam or some shit. I'm gonna leave it there, baby boss. No, I'm not. I'm gonna pull you Oracle cards. All right, but I, I'm getting any way you're gonna stop supporting this person because I feel like somebody's like, very sneaky, deviant like, and like I feel like somebody would somebody would go behind your back and betray you in a heartbeat to have what you have or to to date who you're dating or to be doing what you're doing. I feel like somebody would they would they would throw you under the bus in a heartbeat for anything. All right. I feel like somebody's kind of ruthless. All right, let's see. All right, baby boss, oracle uh, cards, please. We have black cat, yeah, because I'm getting like you, I'm getting you're having somewhat of a lucky streak. You're just doing very well, or you've been doing very well for a very long time. I feel like somebody they can't figure out how to get on their like they can't figure out how to get on track, or they can't they can't figure their life out. All right, so they just they kind of just ignore you or neglect you, or they don't even show interest in what you're doing because. Okay, it's it's, it's kind of hard for me to explain. Yeah, we have the change card. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting also, I'm getting to you keep changing or you keep, you keep metamor you keep metamorphosing. So I'm getting like you keep changing for the better though. Like every, every year you change, you, you make more money, you succeed more, you achieve more, you become more distinguished every time you do something. Yeah, so I'm, I'm also getting to you have the ability to, re to reinvent yourself over and over again. So it's almost like you're a new person every year, every month. Okay, there's, there's always excitement. So I feel like somebody, they're kind of bitter about that or something like that. Something's going on here. Yeah, because you're powerful. Yeah, I'm getting you're very powerful. People listen to you. People follow you. You just, you have, you, you seem to have shit figured out here. All right? At least for the most part, you, you seem to be very well taken care of and you take very good care of yourself. All right, yeah, we have power. Yeah, I'm literally getting like somebody wants to steal your energy. Like they want your energy. Like somebody wants to like, Still your life force or some real shit. All right, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this helps you. Bye.